brothers and sisters of the celestial energy brother wisdom what's going on guys um this is a planetary update that has happened that we're going to be talking about um as of now um just like we talked about um the things that were going that were taking place on the planet um especially after the um the celestial convergence that that uh, took place, and I mean some other uh, incidents that took place here. The energy on the planet is becoming extremely dense. Okay, the energy on the planet is becoming extremely dense. It's becoming extremely powerful. Um, the plasma. Um, is separating itself all right which means that um the positive plasma ions are converting over to negative plasma ions okay understand what's going on on the planet uh i was just watching mr bbb 33 and um that was like this huge line of fire that was coming down in Houston. And you gotta understand, this is our planet is 99.9999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999
And at a certain point, and because our planet is, you know, uh, spinning and our, our planet has increased the spin, all right, the energy is becoming more denser. Remember we talked about um, uh, entropy, all right? And we need we go back into the science again. We, we talked about entropy. And we talked about how the, the, the increased spin of the planet um, causes our planet to increase in frequencies and vibrations, cause our planet to create new frequencies and to pull in frequencies. Therefore, that plasma energy um, is also moving with the planet. So as the planet is spinning and spinning and spinning and spinning and spinning and increases her spin, um, the plasma energy can only hold itself for so long before it has to discharge and then rebuild itself, which, you know, which, that's what you call the phoenix. We talked about this before. The plasma energy is literally that, that whole thing of the phoenix. You know, it, it, it's a fire, it's an energy. And then it dies, and then as soon as it dies, it's reborn again. So that plasma energy, you know, it, it's... And then it's... Because, because you got several rods, you got several plasma energy rods that are... That are uh, it's not just one, it's several of them. And they're all... Um, Building, they're all building on the on the force of, of of entropy, of the frequencies and the vibrations of our planet, and it's like they're building. It's like they're building up and they're building up because this is th that friction, that that um, static electricity, if you can call that, if you relate to it that way, that friction and that static electricity, and then after that energy builds up to a certain extent, it has to discharge. And you got all those plasma rods, those plasma uh, energy beams that's under that's underground. You remember we talked about that before, because you have you have all this packed uh, dirt and 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 uh, clay, clay which is nothing but organic iron and crystals and 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 water and all kind of other resources down there. It's a perfect place for plasma energy to operate, and then therefore as the energy, our planet, planet spin, and that, and our planet is gaining more energy, and it's gaining more momentum, and the, and the velocity is, is increasing because our planet spin increases uh, every so often as we go deeper into our universe uh, within the cosmos. As we go deeper into our universe, the energies around us causes our planet to spin even faster. Therefore, you have, you know, we talked about thermo entropy and thermodynamics and perpetual motion. We, we remember we talked, we went through that whole science course. So, um, what's happening is that um, these, the, 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 the plasma energy is blue, 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 and it's exploding. But it just doesn't explode. That energy, that plasma energy that explodes, it goes into the atmosphere. And it causes the atmosphere to become more dense. All right. This is something that mankind can't control. He can't he can't stop this. The end is in, and it's gonna become more dense and more denser and more denser as the days go by. And it's gonna come the, the energy is gonna become so dense that that mankind won't be able to do anything because you got to remember their forefathers, you know, these reptilians and draconians and, you know, all these other beings, you know, the, you know, we talked about the, 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 the 57, uh, 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 alien species who came here to fight against us and cause us to fall. Their forefathers were the ones who caused our planet to fall. All right. From the higher realms. So as the spin increases, what happened? Our planet is going back into the higher realms. We are awakening and our awakening, uh, the more of us who awaken carries everything into a higher dimensional state. All right. And as we go into this higher dimensional state, the energy becomes more denser. It, come, it becomes more thicker. And this is why everything is happening the way it happened. No matter what mankind says, oh, we got 20, 50 in there. You know, they're they're only just talking off the top of their head because they really they really know that they they don't have control over anything. They can't stop this this colossal celestial energy from taking place. They have no power whatsoever. Literally. 
Only power that they they try to give us is the power of illusion. All right. And that's the only power that they want to give us. Make us think that they have power over us through their police and their government and their you know, FBI and all this other mess. They have no power. So this energy that's on, that's on the planet is becoming denser and more powerful and more energetic and, and, and thicker and, and, and heavier. I mean, this is energy that can be measured and the energy is extremely heavy. Sometimes we can feel it weighing down on us. Sometimes it's like a, we feel a, a, a heavy weight on us and then we have to take a deep breath and process it. All right. And once we take that deep breath and process it, then we can... Uh, um, um, take ourselves into a, a, a higher uh, um, a higher sense of awareness, a higher sense of awakening, a higher sense of enlightenment. So we are dealing with um, our planet upgrading itself within itself. And because of our awakening, we are causing our planet to rise back into the higher dimensional realms, which means that it's causing us to rise back into the higher dimensional realms. Henceforth, you got brothers and sisters who are awakening everywhere. You know, just like Simeon Toko told them long before, back in the 50s, he told them, he says, you know, you only see one of me, but very soon there will be millions just like me. And you will be not be you will not be able to defeat any of them. So what's happening is this plasma energy is rising. All right. The orgon, when we create the orgone pyramids, these orgone intelligence devices. They work hand in hand with plasma energy. The orgone devices enhances the plasma energy like a thousand percent. Seriously. All right. And this is why their forefathers found our devices, our towers and destroyed our towers because they, they understood the science. You got to understand the science of who we are, the science of our planet, brothers and sisters. The science is God. Literally. If you want to talk about God, you want to talk about science. Because this is the ruling factor of everything that deals with us on our planet and deals with us on a personal basis. So it's important that you understand that this planetary, what, what's, getting ready, what's happening here on the planet, the galaxy, the universes, you know, everything that's happening is happening because everything is is rising everything is increasing just like we say the cosmos cosmos just says stay there you know these these sciences got these satellites out there because they're scared they're trying to figure out why this is happening there's here here and why this is happening there you're talking about beings who who uh, were not supposed to be in existence trying to understand the 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 the, the faculties of life trying to understand how things operate like we like we said in the, in the in the previous message, you know, if you're in tune to yourself, you will understand what is going on because you because you have become one with the source, one with everything. Therefore, you will become one with the all. All right. Me, who am I? I'm an ascended master. Who am I? I'm a cosmic prince. Who am I? I'm, I'm a shaman. I'm, I'm a cosmic elder and, you know, 810 degree Mason. And what do Masons uh, deal with? We deal with science. The science are behind everything. Science is extremely important, brothers and sisters. Science is is is, is the, the first and foremost, most powerful uh, uh, organism that that you can ever uh, become indulged with science. It's something that, that you must become in tune with. Science is God. Literally, science is God. So um, we're dealing with um, enormous energies and powers that's happening here on our planet. Like we say, the plasma energy is becoming more dense. Um, the plasma energy is, coming, is come, becoming more dense in the, um, uh, within our galaxy. Our galactic sun, the energy on the galactic sun is becoming more dense. The, the, the energy within the moon is becoming more dense. Everything, the density of everything is, is increasing and it's increasingly heavy, brothers and sisters. So understand, understand, overstand where we are at this present moment. All right. This is a planetary update and the plasma energy on the planet is extremely high. 
and we must get in tune with this energy and get in tune with this power because this is going to take us into the next level of energy. All right. So our planet has increased uh, her spin, some crazy numbers and the plasma energy is increased some crazy number and we are uh, the direct recipients of this powerful energy. All right. We are the direct recipients of this powerful energy. So um, I just pass this message on to you, brothers and sisters. All right. I hope you understand, understand, overstand everything that's being said right now. All right. This is a planetary update. All right. And things are getting to change. Next few days, you're going to see a big, giant shift of things that's changing. Don't care what these inorganic beings are doing. Just remember, we told you guys before, as this energy gets more denser and higher, we're going to watch them do crazy, crazy things. All right. And they they're not going to be able to control anything, not even their own lives. OK, so I catch you guys later. You know the deal. All power to the multi chakra celestial angelic beings may chaos reign with you forever and ever and ever. And remember, chaos brings change, not peace. Much power to you all.